Right now, preparations are underway at Raymond James Stadium in Tampa ahead of Super Bowl 55. We have less than two weeks before the Bucks face off against the Chiefs in the big game. Late this afternoon, the NFL gave an update on what's being done ahead of kickoff. News 6's Carolina Cardona is in studio with the latest. Carolina. Guys, well, as the Tampa Bay Buccaneers and the Kansas City Chiefs prepare to take the field, it's all hands on deck right now. The NFL is preparing to get every detail just right at Raymond James Stadium for Super Bowl, Super Bowl 55 and as well as during the Super Bowl experience, which will take place in downtown Tampa's Riverwalk opening on January 29th. Today, during a virtual press conference, NFL Vice President and Head of Live Event Production and Operations, John Barker said, they are on schedule and feel confident everything will be in place. An event, of course, being held as we continue to battle COVID-19. The NFL says they are taking every precaution possible to ensure the event does not turn into a super spreader event. It might look a little bit different for a Super Bowl this year, but certainly the excitement is there, the energy is there, the community is there, and, and certainly having um, the Bucks in the game this year just adds to the storyline of what will be Super Bowl 55. Um, from a COVID-19 planning perspective, we feel strongly where we are there as well. Um, and we've had 17 weeks to learn, change, adapt, learn, change, adapt. And we just continue to do that and refine those plans. And we're very confident in what we're doing here, making sure that we have physical distancing, making sure that we are watching our vertical movements. Every fan, every uh, guest, every person that is working at the stadium, when they arrive, will receive a KN95 mask, will receive uh, bacterial wipes, will receive hand wipes, will receive sanitizer. Barker also said the stadium is being sanitized every day, including the air filtration system. In terms of the Super Bowl experience, at 6, I'll have details about the passes for fans and safety measures being put into place. I'll also tell you what he said about the halftime show. That's more coming up at 6.